we have some real Friday the 13th vibes out there this morning. Some dense fog starting to work in across parts of the capital region. As you can see, not much to see as we're looking out with our East Greenbush camera at Adirondack Orthodontics. Things are a little bit drier where we are seeing that fog come in. So kind of a twofold part of some impacts that are going to be imp uh, affecting your morning commute. Visibility right now at Albany International down to three miles. Similar story in Pittsfield. You can see most spots dealing with at least some limited visibility. We also have uh, some rain falling, especially from Albany towards the north and west. You can see steadier rain coming out of Schoharie County, hopping up into the Mohawk Valley, southern Adirondacks, cutting across Saratoga, Warren, Washington counties. Uh, still a little bit of freezing rain possible in some of the higher spots across the Adirondacks, also into the southern Green Mountains from Albany south and east. There is some rain out there. It's just a little bit more scattered, and we will be dealing with more of these showers as we continue through the first part of your Friday. The storm system that brought us, of course, snow this time yesterday, continuing to work its way across New York State. Behind it, not carrying a whole lot of moisture, but instead, there is some chillier air that's going to be working in, and that is going to be the story as we go into the second part of the day. For the time being, we are tracking more rain, some climbing temperatures through about lunchtime. From there, the rain's going to be shutting down, and eventually temperatures will be falling. We'll spike close to 50 late this morning, but by the time you're coming home from work today, temperatures will be closer to freezing, should be all dry, but as these temperatures continue to fall overnight, you do want to be on the lookout for some slick, potentially icy spots as temperatures will be settling into the 20s and the January chill is here to stay as we enter the weekend. So rain comes to an end around lunchtime. From there, temperatures will drop. 47 are high today by tonight. We're going to be down into the 20s. There even could be some teens out there as well. Skies will stay cloudy. Wouldn't be surprised, especially with the cold air in place. A little bit of moisture, maybe a few flurries fly through the night and into the start of the day. Saturday, highs only in the lower 30s as we get the weekend started. It does get a little bit brighter. Sunday, still all dry and quiet on Martin Luther King Day. Monday, then we're bringing back the 40s along with some rain chances next Tuesday and Wednesday. Uh, but all in all, this January thaw, it's still going for us.